What's up you guys, welcome back to the channel, you new subscribers, I'm Barbas. Um, you guys just watched the video and I went ahead and I painted the wheels on the Civic because we are preparing ourselves um, because I have tires that are on the way. They were supposed to be here yesterday, they never got here. So I went ahead, I laid paint about four days ago to get these tires, these uh, wheels uh, really nice and clean because I don't know if you guys remember but you can see like a little bit of surface rust on there. But now they look really nice. And the only thing I'm really waiting on is those tires. They were supposed to be here yesterday. I ordered some Lion Claw off eBay. They're way bigger than this. There's sport tires that are on the way. They were supposed to be here yesterday, like I said. And can't find this guy. This guy is nowhere to be seen. I need those tires. It's, it's late in the afternoon. I wanted to get these tires mounted. Go visit my boy Henry and get the tires mounted. But this guy is nowhere to be seen. So we're just going to continue waiting and see if the tires will get here. Somebody just rung the doorbell. So I'm going to go check. And hopefully my tires are here. Oh yeah, she meaty. How are you gonna drop off one tire? What the hell am I supposed to do with one tire? This is a little bit ridiculous. So this FedEx guy dropped off one tire. What am I supposed to do with one tire? It's not a wheelbarrow. So now I'm gonna have to wait around some more and just keep waiting on this tires to get here. This is ridiculous. It has literally been about three or four hours. And I am missing two tires still, or one tire. So new game plan, since I'm missing a tire, I'm not waiting for this guy no more. I'm gonna take those two tires and we're gonna go ahead and get them mounted and get them on here. Get them in the backs only for now. And then tomorrow, or later on, when my last tire gets here, we'll go ahead and get the other one mounted. But probably tomorrow, so I'm not gonna go back to Henry's. But check this out. Huge difference. Look at that tire. Look at this one. I'm gonna have to take the hammer and the grinder to my boys in case I gotta 
pound this all together but you guys can see that that other rim is sitting really low so that means it's gonna raise so that's gonna give me clearance up here do you guys see how massive that tire looks so i'm gonna throw these tires in the car and we're gonna head over to my boys oh yeah and i'm gonna throw some tools in here too I got the hammer, some snips, and the grinder. And maybe I should take a pipe in case I gotta roll these fenders in the back. So I just went in there and my boy Henry's not in. Um, he's got a worker right now um, by himself and he's got an SUV that he's working on right now. He's replacing both of those tires. So I'm gonna have to wait. We are do losing uh, day daylight. So it is gonna get dark pretty soon. So I might record depending how the lighting is. But either way, if you guys need tires, this is the little shop right here. This is where you guys gotta come if you're in Aurora. He'll hook you up. Today's the day after, we're back at my house. I stopped recording because it got pretty dark. And let me tell you guys that I'm still waiting for the FedEx guy to bring the last tire. Um, as soon as it gets here today, we'll probably go take it over there. But I'm thinking maybe before we do that, I'll take off the tires from the rear, put them in the front, and see if I'm gonna have any clearance issues. Because I don't know if I'm gonna need a spacer to kick the tire or the, the rim out a little bit because i'm thinking it might hit in one of my arms in the front one of the bars that run across the front it might hit i'll show you guys in my next video but let me go ahead and show you guys the result of what this looks like You guys can see that it filled up the the wheel well pretty good and i don't have any any problems right now with clearance it doesn't rub or anything but i'm gonna go ahead and roll this little lip right here just in case if i put some weight in here i really don't want anything to rub so i might just do that off camera but yeah i can't wait till i get those tires in the front end it's gonna jack up the front so much taller it's gonna look great either way the train's about to go by right now i'll catch you guys on my next video till then peace out catch you guys later
like button. Make sure that that like button.